you don't know already, the glycemic index is just a rating of um, the rate at which uh, a food can increase both blood sugar and insulin release when you eat it. So things like white bread and sugar and glucose are like 100 or even higher. I think sugar is on the glycemic index. And that just means it stimulates a rapid release of insulin and a rapid rise in blood, blood sugar. Uh, but that only really matters if you're eating too much food. Actually, I, let me rephrase that. That doesn't matter. What matters is how much food you're actually eating. So if you are interested in weight loss um, or even even weight maintenance, it's the amount of food you're eating that's going to cause you to either maintain your weight or lose weight, um, not the glycemic index of that food. Um, so, if you're o so if you're overeating, let's say your BMR is 1,800 calories and you overeat by 2,000 calories, so you eat 3,800 calories, but all the extra food is low glycemic index food, you're still going to gain weight. It doesn't matter what the glycemic index is of the food if you just eat too much food. Conversely, if you're under eating, and all the food that you're eating is high glycemic index food and your BMR is 1800 calories but you only eat 1000 calories a day you're still going to lose weight even if all thousand of those calories is sugar it doesn't it doesn't matter um, you can't build fat mass out of out of nothing if you under eat you're going to lose weight so the answer with the glycemic index is so what um, it doesn't matter it's only the amount of calories that you eat that matters